Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yeah, my name is Obi Precious, and here is Obi Precious family. So I have my my um, lovely people here, my family. We are all here. So guys, today we are here together. We came for a birthday party of our <laughs> our daddy Zikora. And we no, came to celebrate. <laughs> today is not his birthday, but today is the celebration of the birthday. <laughs> <laughs> so we came to celebrate with him to thank God for what God has done in his life. And here we have a discussion. We are talking about something. When is the right time to say yes? Because a lot of ladies and a lot of men, most of them are depressed, frustrated because they don't know the right time to say yes or no they just jump into a relationship from relationship to marriage and that is why you have a lot of broken marriages these days and today we want to start the discussion so i'm going to start by asking our daddy is the a man or a woman should go into a, a marriage or relationship first of all relationship or courtship before a marriage, you have to uh, take an inventory. What I mean is uh, check yourself if you are ready yeah. uh, 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 to mix or to mingle with somebody. You know, a lot of, a lot of times uh, uh, women or men, um, they say they are ready for a relationship, but what they are actually talking about is uh, they are ready for a wedding ceremony. Or celebrations, they just want to just have that, you know, uh, uh, friends and well wishers come together and celebrate with them. They don't really understand uh, uh, when you talk about relationship, when you talk about living with somebody. They don't really understand what it entails. You, yeah. know, you are going to, uh, you know, uh, um, you got, you're going to have a mutual uh, uh, relationship with that person, whereby you have to tolerate uh, uh, one another. There are some uh, uh, flaws in us that. You don't even know whether you can bring it in or you know drop it out so these things are what you have to prepare yourself before you get into a relationship and make up your mind that there are some things you have to drop and there are some things you have to take into a relationship for example your a woman can have a boyfriend that maybe does not uh, uh, take it when it comes to smell and you remove your shoes and then you wear your stockings inside the living room and the whole living room is thinking, smelling from your from your feet. Okay. You know, these are the things. And the man might not even like it. He might not even he has not experienced such a thing in his life. And whereby you bring it in, he would strictly, you know, condone the character. You know, and you on your own side, this is what you have been living with and you think it's okay, you know, that human being our feet are supposed, supposed to smell. You know, these are the things you check some balances. We have to, uh, um, you know, examine ourselves before we engage in a relationship. That is one. Of course, there are many other uh, uh, points, you know, before you can say, okay, I'm ready. I want to uh, commit myself with somebody or have a date with somebody. Thank you. So what do you have to say about uh, this topic? When is the right time for a guy or for a lady to say yes in a relationship? In my own opinion, there is no time. There is no time limit to say yes. Okay. First of all, you have to know the person yeah. you are dealing with. Yeah. Before you start. Yeah. Before you start the relationship. Mm -hmm. so one, you have to learn the character yeah. of the person. Know what you what you can take from the person and what you cannot take. Mistakes, things that goes on in the relationship, forgiveness, that is important. Love, like. All those things are involved before you can say, okay, I'm ready. You can call someone today, tell you I'm ready. Mm -hmm. But those things, those things are what make the relationship to be what it is. Yeah. You know, before you can say anything. So there is no, there is no time limit in relationship. One can be in a, with a guy, a, a guy can be with a lady for six months and say, okay, I'm ready. And the woman is ready as well. You know, some people can say in one year, some people can say in two years. It depends on how you can learn the person, understand the person, how you feel about the person, what you can let go and what you can deal with. 
then you can make it happen. We learn every day, even in the relationship as well. You continue learning. Oh. You continue learning yeah. the person. Mm -hmm. No one is perfect. Okay. So relationship is all about well, learning the person you are dealing with. So mm -hmm. time, time, there is no time limit in it. There is no time frame. Oh, it's, it's going to be six months. Or oh, telling yourself, 2002, I must get married. You have to get to know the person, learn the person, understand the person. Fit those things first okay. before you before you are ready for it. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. So, what do you have to say in this topic? Um, what I have to say when is when it's right to say yes in a relationship. Yeah. Yeah, you've got to know who you are dealing with. Yes. Because and live with no kidlo, kidlo, also by the non Nigeria vice Melana. So, all of you need to know how to know where by It's a lot of so you have to examine yourself in a no way because na eya gwa go do nwe ga ezoku na ndi igbosi na nwoke oka obu na tolulu se ndi acho na inu wa ye bu go do zo me wu mo beli he when now we go here and now by any man and Makudumbo because now only he is where Banana and Yamiva. I obviously hate each other again. Mana, before I do to I in the no of my in the no of Muna to well of my papa of my because now I will help you with the kind of Guelana. Mana Bruno no go moon is open. A man uh, only a go for me. Yeah. Because na as now na wo aba aba e well alu nute. Yeah. Obu roko dele um na fu ni yo nyo nyo umazi na mezikita. Ano ke tefu efu efu dim ba puta na mero do. To se bulano well flower. Se mo ai kwe eh eh biya kwe len biya sim eh. Oh na biya sim eh. Ken dia ba kola. Mama, na kete. If you marry, eh, in my life, in my likeness, or love, love on somebody, natural, yeah. If you marry, na ni, man, if you walk alone, yeah, you have a bunu bigi. Let him travel from you. Yeah. Eh, na kete zo fu chichi zeh ku ku akaka. E se ma e se a ne biya we equal biya ku mi yes. So one. I am uh, before you now been into the relationship. Do you want go for me? Only again, you are not me. Do you want to go for me? Oh no, now we will not see. Eh, eh. Oh now, my no no, for you, you know the aga very well. Yeah. So, come put over to this one. I need to come back to go for us. Okay, darling, darling. This relationship of a thing. Do you know that so many men or so many ladies pretend to love someone when they do not? Maybe they were like, okay, because of money, this guy has money, he can take care of my needs and all that. And because of that, the guy now uh, convinced the lady that he loved him or her. And after everything, the, everything now scatters. So what do you have to say? In that uh, area, I think it is then it is important having checked yourself and uh, you want to give yourself into a relationship then the next step on my own opinion is to seek the face of god yeah to pray about it not just a casual prayer but an intensive uh, uh, prayer because when you talk about relationship you are talking about exchange of lifestyle exchange of destiny and whatever you may have. So talking about relationship also entails emotional and mental. Yeah. Uh, so all these things, putting them together, you find out that you cannot deal it on your own. Uh, because uh, when it comes to spirit, uh, we have to uh, call, consult the spirit. Yeah. Uh, so in this area, you have to call upon God. You know that, Father, I am ready you know, to enter into the next level. 
-hmm. you know, reveal to me, strengthen me, empower me. Because you need, just like somebody that is going to his or her next season, or if you are here in this country, you want to enter from summer to winter, you have to get your boots ready for the snow, you have to get your jacket ready for the, for the weather. So all these things you have to prepare yourself, just like the Bible said, putting on the whole armor of God. So in a relationship, you have to fortify yourself in the area of spiritual, yeah. emotional, physical, and mental wise. Okay. Yeah, so you have to pray to God about it. That is number one before you can, because nobody knows the heart of men except God. Thank you. Along the line, mm -hmm. you now find out that um, what you went for is not what you are seeing again. What do you do? Um, if in any case, mm -hmm. uh, in that case, you have to, like I said, if you consult your Heavenly Father, uh, He will go ahead of you and give you your right partner. You will surely. And if that partner comes from God, I will encourage you to stick your life to it. It will never fail. Uh, because He has the final say. And whatever He gives us is the best. God's gift is the best. There is never a time unless you break your own covenant of that marriage. Yeah, but when you give yourself into a marriage and pray about it and God gives you your own and you know that this is from God, you have that conviction, you have that, you have that full assurance, you have to go in. And if anything should go wrong, check yourself. Either you have fallen short of that, uh, your commitment in that relationship or... Whatever that is happening, God is still involved. You have to consult who has called you into that marriage and he will smoothen the, the path for you. How do you know that this person is from God? How? After praying and all that, what are the signs? How First of all, I will, not, I, will not, I will not advise you to enter into a marriage without, without receiving from God. And how do you know that this person is from God? You, 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 you have to get involved in prayer you have, god will definitely reveal it to you it can be through dream it can be through uh, uh, revelation it can be through prophecy it can be true and in any area you receive those uh, uh, speaking or, or or revelation from god you can also test it because the bible said that he's not an author of confusion yeah. so you can also test that voice that you heard Lord, if this is actually you speaking, I want you to confirm me too, so, 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 and so way. And you have to get yourself deeply involved because it's a matter of destiny we are yeah. talking about. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, how do you know she's the one? Did you see her in the dream? Just tell us a little about your relationship before marriage. Okay, since you said I should tell you a little, I thought you wanted to hear the whole story. But when you requested for a little, I prayed about it and God revealed it to me. Okay. In the dream or? No, it wasn't in the dream. PlayStation. 